up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? It's your boy Kevin to turn on this motherfucking YouTube shit. What's up? What's up? It's sh show boy. Can't you tell on the do do shit? Hey man, say man, we are lit, eh? Lit through my fucking teeth, man. Turn up, 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 turn up. Today? To my fucking day? J Hood and outside crib shit, man. Hey man, say man, we out here. For the one time, one time, man. Turn up with your boy. Big crib out here, man. Hey man, say man, um, a lot of shit been going on, man. And your boy back out here for the one time, one time, trying to get tank, 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 tank. Make sure y'all like and subscribe these videos up, man. We trying to go crazy. Straight to the top, man. Appreciate for all the support y'all been giving a nigga, man. Just keep on liking and sharing, man. All right, boom, man. Hey man, say man. We finna talk about yak, man. Kodak Black, man. Hey, man, say, man, one of my favorite artists of all time, top five, you did. Um, uh, you feel me? Man, all the heat, super grimly, you know what I'm saying, going crazy. So, um, uh, if y'all did not know, bruh, um, Drake helped find Yak, you know what I'm saying? With some of his old music, with, um, no flocking and shit. It kind of blew him up because Drake reacted to it and Kodak went crazy. You know what I'm saying? But Cardi always in some type of mood against Drake because he like, oh, okay, it's cool that you gave me a shout out, but you, we didn't do no song together. So he can he really, he never did like, a, really accept like the shout out because he's like, bro, it's cool and everything. You gave me a little like react to my song, but you think you could at least do the song with me. Type shit. So I always thought it was some type of drama between that shit. But you know, Kodak, like, Kodak fuck with Drake. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day. So, um,. So this is, we don't go, we ain't gonna talk about Drake right now. We don't talk about uh, how eight Atlanta records did not pick, was not, was not gonna pick up Yak, Kodak Black, one of the greatest rappers of all times. Imagine if they did not pick up Kodak Black. And we never got to hear what Kodak Black and how awesome, great, you know what I'm saying, his music is, you dig? That shit is wild, man, you know what I'm saying, because it's wild. Northside shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Big crip out here. It's why because, you know what I'm saying? Now we see this nigga top, top five greatest artists of all time. How the fuck a lot of records was not gonna pick up Yak? But they would have missed out on one of the best rappers of all of this generation. What the world, bro? That shit is wild, man. So, um, I guess his manager was like, man, whoop, 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 whoop. Sign that nigga. What the fuck are you talking about? And, you know what I'm saying? His manager helped him really get into Signing Yak and shit because you know what I'm saying they wasn't really fucking with Yak. They said that nigga was ass. Huh? Imagine. But that was but that's crazy because they did the same thing about X. But it wasn't about because his music. It was mostly about his drama off of the um outside of music. So they didn't want to sign that nigga because of that. But it's weird because you know now we see that Yak. I think Yak signed the Capital. Bro, any record label would be gladly to have Yak on a on a on a label. I bet I bet Atlantic Records like, man, this shit is wild, bro. We didn't we done sign one of the best rappers of all time, and and we and we almost didn't want the want the motherfucker. Wow, shit, man. It just shows the same man. You never know who got talent, man. And y'all judge Y'all judge motherfuckers off of the first reaction to instinct, bro. Y'all be losing out on the mo on the best rapper of all time. You feel me? But um, uh, damn, I, I think I lost my thing. I'm not in. Yeah, man, you miss out. You miss out on the best rappers of all time, man. You feel me? But um, uh, when you got hard work and dedication, you just keep on going, man. Certain doors are open up just to open up because you know what I'm saying. People see dedication and hard work. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Ain't, 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 you know, the person who, who, cause you know, Kanye didn't even get, Kanye West, you know what I'm saying? He didn't even get, um, they people, they who was going to, they didn't even like him. They didn't fuck with that nigga. One of the best artists of all time now, of this generation. You know what I'm saying? As a black people like Jew, man, you know what I'm saying? I feel like, we don't get as much chances as a lot of motherfuckers, man, and when we get our chances, we gotta make sure, like, 
we put it all online, no cap, because these niggas not trying to give us nothing, bro. They trying to, they really just want to take and give us nothing at the end of the day. So it's surprising that you know what I'm saying. Some artists actually making in this or uh, label, label, you know what I'm saying? Because like they ain't trying to get nobody. If you ain't trying to like no son track away and sound like oh, you know what I'm saying? Weird ass shit. They ain't finna fuck with you. So um, it came out that Drake. Had did an album with 21 Savage. Do your thing, 21. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And, um, I really, I listened to a little bit of it, but I know I didn't really like it. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really a, the biggest Drake fan. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, listen to his music, Drake is not like the most. I gotta listen to Drake. I gotta listen to this. I gotta listen to 21 Savage. Because I don't listen to 21 Savage like that. So it's like, I gotta listen to 21 Savage and Drake. Nah, because I don't really fuck with him like, like that. You know what I'm saying? I listen to a couple of songs, you know, so they popping and shit. But nah, man. You know, and 21 Savage talking about, um, yeah, man, I got the best, Rick. I got the best numbers and all this. Whoop, whoop, I'm making going crazy. I'm better than everybody in the motherfucking. Whoop, 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 whoop. And they gave him, like, the best artist of this gener- or that 2022. But I'm like, bro, you got, you working with Drake, one of the biggest rappers of, of all time, bro. And you talking shit about how good you is when, bro, any, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's, that's when Drake, nigga, you didn't do no collabs by yourself. You didn't do no song by yourself. You didn't do nothing by yourself. And, and this man want to talk about, yeah, man, you know, I don't have, I don't, I don't, I'm the one of the best rappers of all time. Bruh, back in the day when he first came out, yeah, he was a fire. Murder gang, you know what I'm saying? Now it's just, I ain't, it's all right, you know what I'm saying? But, so, so Kodak talking about, he said, man, since you did a thing with, with 21 Savage, cause Kodak called 21 Savage out, he told that nigga, man, okay, we gonna see what you gonna do. You, you talk all this shit, let's see if you stand in heat. You feel me? So, man, so he get mad at 21 Savage, no cap. So 21 Savage, like, man, he fought the smoke and all that shit, man. We gonna see what's gonna happen on, on that little ish. But then Yak was talking like, yeah, man, he gonna wait to 2023 and like um February or March to do a, a album with Drake. Cause I guess he's trying to let the heat the heat die, die down with the 21 Savage and, and, and Drake album. You know what I'm saying? Like they already boosted up on that album, so he's trying to wait to like he get his chance at his album with Drake and he gonna try to go crazy on that. You feel me? Would, would I be listening to a whole 21? But I would, but I be listen to a whole Kodak and Drake album. I really don't know, man. I mean, like I said, I fuck with, I fuck with Kodak Black. But listening to Drake, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what type of, what type of lyrics he bring to the, to the album. You feel me? Like I fuck with Drake on some, some way. You know what I'm saying? Cause he's a legend and shit. But you know what I'm saying? I'm not just, I just, ooh, I gotta listen to a Drake album. Like that. So, um. So we're gonna see how that goes, man. Um, and the crazy thing is, man, they talking about Drake is trying to retire, bruh. So I guess when Kodak and Drake do they do they final collab, do they first collab together, I guess he's gonna retire, man. You feel me? I guess he ain't gonna do no more songs together. I mean You mean cause he's like almost I think he's like what 40? Almost 40. I mean, you you see people like Jay-Z and like I said, Kanye West and you know, older artists, you know what I'm saying, going crazy. They, they, they still making music, you know what I'm saying? So, it's not, it's not tough to say that, you know what I'm saying, he can still keep on doing music and people gonna fuck with it, you know what I'm saying? You know, look at, cause look at, uh, Diddy, you know what I'm saying? He don't really don't do music, but he get, he get, he get bad bitches, you know what I'm saying? Looking good and shit, you dig? So it's like, I don't, I feel like if he do stop doing music, it's gonna, it's like, it's like, I mean, it's like a really affect the community. Cause I mean, he had like a lot of good songs, girl, like girls and, uh, you know, he had a lot of albums and shit that came out that recently that was pretty good and shit. But, I mean, I guess he tried to just spend time with his son and shit and his family and shit, but, so I'm just really waiting to see if they gonna really do an album together, Drake and Kodak Black, because that'd be a litty ass, um, album, you know what I'm saying? I give it a chance, you feel me, because yak on it, so I'll listen to what they got to say on it, but download the song, I got to see what song's going to be lit, you feel me, because I ain't, let's be 100, I ain't got no Drake song in my, in my, in my media catalog, I ain't got no Drake song, no Drake verse, none of that, I ain't got no 21 Savage song, no 21 Savage verse, you know what I'm saying, I, my, listen to, who I listen to is very limited, you know what I'm saying, really, I got, most of them from Texas, man, so if you ain't from Texas, hood, Northside Creep, 
It's like, I ain't really, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna really listen to you. I'm not, I'm not really listening to you. I listen to some of them because, you know, they get they, they popping and shit. And they have like a good song. They go crazy. But, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, man, we just gonna see um how this thing gonna go, bro. I, really, I mean, I'm waiting for it. You know what I'm saying? Give it a year. If, some, if, he's, if he all still alive, you know what I'm saying? Pretty God, we still stay alive till next year. That's gonna be a litty um, video, you feel me? Um... But uh I don't think I don't think 21 Savage should have won that yak. Talking about he not that good because of his numbers, but one of the best rappers of all time, your numbers are boosted up with Drake and bro, you still more mainstream. You're more mainstream. You you, you got more white kids. You got little little white kids. Look more little white kids look at listen to your shit than yak. You know what I'm saying? Mostly black people listen to yak. The gutter. 21 Savage is more of a bougie hood, you know what I'm saying? So he go he he'll go for the more white people. Higher middle class black people, you know what I'm saying? So it's like bougie acting motherfuckers. So you know what I'm saying? So that was a good um topic he he, he touched on because we gonna see what's gonna happen, man. If Yak, we gonna see we gonna do a verse battle. I don't know what's gonna happen between that shit, man. Make sure you like and subscribe this bitch hood and outside crib, man. We out this bit, man. Yes sir, turn up and outside. Hey dad, you know what I when we link up, dog. This shit be legendary. You know this is instrumental, you the engineer on it, so. Kodak everywhere.